Good day, fine people. My name is Nick. We're back on the Pinball Arcade on the PlayStation 4, Season 6, and this one is Frank Thomas Big Hurt, published by Farsight Studios in 2017, and based on the real life table by Gottlieb from 1995. This is Table Pack 52. The real life table had a unit run, I think, of 1985, and this is based on the game of baseball, which I know absolutely nothing about. So, apologies there. If you're an expert that knows everything about baseball, probably in the States or Canada or anywhere with a knowledge of it, then apologies, I know absolutely nothing. All I know is Babe Ruth, was he one of them, and Madonna from that terrible film. Uh, also, Kevin Costner kept building baseball grounds in the hope that someone would turn up. Is that what happened? Anyway, Frank Thomas, as we look at the playfield there, which I've done a bit of research uh, of, he spent most of his career playing for the Chicago White Sox and a few other teams, and then he retired. So, yeah, the uh, table is set in a baseball ground, and we must get home runs and uh, runs and not get out. The original table had a Rebox logos all over it, but these have been taken off due to licensing issues. So let's play! Right, there's a there's a mitt there, or a baseball glove at the top. I think we have to knock the ball into that, really. Uh, flipper midway up the left-hand side, used to get those targets, adjacent a little bit upper on the right there. Three main channels down the middle, which I think that's the aim. We need to hit the ball down there. Oh, we've activated that already, have we? Maybe. Three balls! As normal, that ramp there I tried to get round goes round the back of things. A couple of pop bumpers, red and a, I think a blue one there on the right. You might be able to see. Lots of flashing lights. Looks a bit like the police force. Yeah, it does look a bit policey, doesn't it? There we go. 1995, this one from Gottlieb. Uh, the last table we reviewed was Indianapolis 500. That was also in 1995. Oops, drain straight down the middle. So you can see the baseball ground in the the bottom of the uh, thing there. Stadium there. We knock it past that. It's a home run. Strike one, you're out. Strike two. No, strike one, strike two, strike three, then you're out. Is that right? Hmm. Love that sound. Diddly did did Although I um, shoot the scoop, right, missed. Although um, although I haven't watched too much baseball, um, that sound at the end, uh, I've probably caught that in cartoons, I think. It's a great sound, so good nostalgia, good retro there. Did it, did did it. Actually, I did say puppy power, that awful scrappy dude. Extra ball available. Try to do the skill shot. Go around. Yeah, so. Activating is all about hitting those middle channels and that mitt. Keep aiming for that and you can't go wrong as we've got multi-ball. Let's try and keep these in. The extra ball we just got there as well. This is going very well. What's the catch here? One sinkhole to the uh, right. Goal five complete. This is going very well indeed. So it's quite easy to get the hang of this one it seems. This is only my first go of it. And uh, yeah, for a real life table, I'm keeping these balls in quite well. Good. If I see this anywhere about, I'm not sure how many are still functional, I've certainly played. I'd love to go to a Pinball X Bowl. Invite me to one. It'd probably be in the United States, I can't afford to get over there, so um, I'm not sure, quite sure how that's going to happen. Unless I was some amazing special guest, and they probably invited JC or someone instead, because, uh, well, I think they're a little bit more famous than me, I'll have to check. Right. Here we go. We're losing our balls quite quickly here. Frank Thomas, big heart. Thank you, Frank Thomas. What other baseball players are there? You might be a collector of baseball cards. I wish I knew a bit more about baseball, but it's just not on UK television. Also, my patience is a bit low. Um, I've tried to get into American football a few times, but I don't, I've never fully understood the rules, and I've got a home run. Bat that out of the park. Diddly bit biddy. Where's a good place to watch baseball? Maybe I can adopt a team. What's a good team to support? The Chicago White Sox? Not sure. The Boston Big Sox? I, I don't know any teams at all. The New York No Sox? They play in bare feet. Boo! Come on. Now, you do have to listen to the announcer on this, what things to hit, as well as the video display. It's always in the top left on uh, Pinball Arcade. I'll try and hold up some of these balls so it's not so frantic. <laughs> I've lost one already. Well done, Nick. You never learn. Right, I'm holding one there on the left. Don't... Let's try and just keep one in and hold that for the time being. Good, better be. No. Good. Right, that's a launch that. 
Good. I'm pretty good at baseball in the pinball version anyway. Uh, in real life, I'm not so good. Mind you though, I never got into cricket at school either. Baseball was seen more as um, like rounders, but I'm sure there's a bit more to it than that. The World Series, and I think mostly it's just, um, just well, it's teams from the US, isn't it? There's no other teams there. Is there any Canadian teams or Japanese teams or even French teams that compete in the World Series? Well, I'd like to go back to 1985 and put some money in the Cubbies. Or something like that. Yeah. Or back to the beginning of the season and put some money in the Cubbies. That was that line from Back to the Future uh, Part 2. Is there a Back to the Future table that Pimple Arcade can recreate? I hope so, that would be pretty stunning. Let me know if there's a Back to the Future table. Because eventually, Pimple Arcade will fast eight studios who produce this. They're on such a good run, they've done so many tables. I can only see it's a matter of time before they've recreated everything and then we'll have to design their own tables from scratch. Well that's game over, well, you know, we might have another quick go at this. Yeah, I, I just I just love seeing these real tables recreated. I mean, there's absolutely zero chance. Well, I suppose about 0.5% chance. I'll see these in the real world. So this is the closest it's going to get. Uh, when technology gets cheap enough, I'll certainly be getting the virtual reality headset. So it looks like I am playing it for real. That'd be pretty awesome. To actually fill the table, that'd be the next thing, like pressure gloves or something. And these tables never need repairing unless your com well, unless your console blows up. Batter up! Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Right, let's try and get the ball. <laughs> Drain already! Let's try and get the ball in that mitt there. Got to time it right. Strike one. I suppose it works, doesn't it? Strike one, strike two, strike three. Because you've got three balls here. This is strike two. I'm trying to get a skill shot. <laughs> Come on, extra power. Oh god, what's happened? I think the spring's broke. Skill shot. Now we get it up the ramp, we've got a skill shot here. Yeah! Home run, but then the ball drained immediately afterwards. Well done, Nick. Right, we need to get this ball to last a while here. Mind you though, did that... I think we just restarted there, didn't it? Didn't, oh, that's going to go wrong. Yeah, now it is the last ball for real. Right, I need the extra ball. Give me the extra ball. What do I have to hit for extra ball? No! Actually, if the, it's good this table, because if you lose the ball straight away, it does give you an extra chance, and I've just lost three balls in a matter of about a minute or so. You can't relax on these. You think you're doing well, but as soon as you start relaxing, you start losing. Oh. Have I got extra ball through all that? I've suddenly gone absolutely rubbish. Nicky's gone rubbish again. Well, you know, my gameplay does vary, and that's it, is it? Curses, blast, kapoo. I'm not having any of that. That was one of my worst goes ever. The first go was quite good, wasn't it? And I said it was quite easy, and then I went terrible. Maybe I just got lucky the first time. Let's get it in the mid. <laughs> What's happened to my special skills? Ugh. Right, well, you're never gonna get you're never gonna get walkthroughs from me where I complete the whole game. It might have happened once, but or maybe twice, but you know. We're just having a laugh here. We're all a, a big group of guys and girls, and we uh, we discuss the games. We have a laugh. We're pretty much in a in a pub or in a in a community area, and we're just all together talking about games and being a bit silly. It's not too serious here. And even when there is a bit of a serious video, which is rare, uh, at least we can uh, discuss thoughts of the day. I think most of you got that. Occasionally, I get a nutcase who don't quite understand it. And use it as a soapbox platform for hate. Boo! Home run. Now, if I was Homer Simpson, I'd be wanting some food right now. I want some nachos. I want a hot dog. Diddly did diddy. I want lots of food now to watch baseball. Uh, anything with beef will be good. Oh, get it through the middle. Diddly da. Thundercats. Is there a Thundercats table? I'm just I'm just saying random themes now. Yes? No. Mind you, I activated something there. Goal 2 complete. Maybe I'll get a trophy in a minute. What do you think? Diddly did diddy. Call double ease. Muddy ball. Strike 1. Yeah. 
Do you play boost baseball? Are you are like more of a pitcher or a batter or a fielder? What other positions are there? I'd like to be a hot dog stand um, person. Ice cream. Talking about ice cream. What about a speedball two theme table? Doesn't exist in the real world, but there'll be some great sounds for it. Maybe that's more for Zen Pinball 2 to do. They did do a Bethesda pack based on Doom, uh, Far Cry, those sort of ones. That was uh, quite good. Well, Doom is good. Better than the other two. Right, let's try and hit a few things. Let's get to, let's get to first base. That's what I was always trying to do when I go out. Oh dear. You make the call. That's, that, that sound just reminds me of the arcades when I was, well, I was early teens, well, late teens really. Multi ball again. Is it two balls or more? Good, we got multi ball. Multi ball looks like two balls at most here. That's a bit of a shame. I'd like to see more. Two balls isn't really multi ball, is it? It's like double ball. I think the minimum minimum for multi ball is you want like three or not or naught that I got there. Well done. Yes, yeah, so my first go... Oh, I've got, an, I've got another ball, have I? Or have I not? Is that it? No, I've got another ball. Here we go. Skill shot. Good the way the uh, table pulls away there when you shoot. Come on, Nicky. Do your stuff. Go, go. You're the man. If you can't do it, no one can, will. Can. Can, can. This music is, um, okay. No, oh, look. That ga I'll be alright if it wasn't that gap down the middle. And my flippers are ten times as big. I'll be quite good. And the ball is a bit bigger. Uh, yeah, I'll be great. And had a magnet. If I had all those things, I'd be pretty good. I think that's the end. That's the end of our Hurt for today. I hope you liked having a look at that one. That was Frank Thomas Big Hurt on the Pinball Arcade. Published by Farsight Studios in 2017. And built, well, based on the real life table by Gottlieb from 1995. Thanks for watching that one as always. If you've got any comments about this table, any of those questions I asked, or any other tables we reviewed so far, then please put it below. And to next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye.